I do think that the announcement of the federal government, Trudeau's recent announcement to push through three pipelines in Canada, and then Trump obviously pushing through the executive order to have the Keystone advanced and the Dakota Access Pipeline advanced only after only four days in office. This speaks to a longer history of how Indigenous people are expendable in both these countries. Um, but it also um, is an example of how uh, the state is going to push through these extractive industries no matter what cost. And the human lives, we like to think that we're countries that uphold our people. You know, we're just, we're free, we have free speech. But these are not acts of uh, th these are not acts of democracy. They're not acts that support what we say our constitution supports. They're actually acts of war on indigenous people. And I think we're going, we're basically starting the first chapter of a great war. And it's going to be the war for our land and the wa war for our water and it's indigenous people that are, that are basically leading that fight.